I never planned to become a teacher, but when my middle son, uh, Nicholas, was seven years old, I found out that he was dyslexic. Sort of researched it and found out what help he needed, but I then became interested in finding other ways to help people learn. My main job in the college is course tutor for students with learning disabilities. I also teach on the basic skills course. I teach a Computers Don't Bite course, which is a class that I um, sort of designed and planned about eight years ago. She's had such a, a wonderful response to this course that often we can't cope with the numbers of people. Debbie is very good. Even me being a student or in my work capacity, because I'm a support worker with people with learning disabilities, if there's something not right, I can go to Debbie. She's always got time for everybody and if, if she hasn't got time when the problem arises then she will make time for it. She comes to you, she explains stuff and makes it the, enjoyable for you to understand. The main challenge when you're working with students with learning disabilities is their self-esteem. Developing their confidence uh, through finding things that they are good at doing and praising them. It's not any good unless they really feel they've done it well. So you have to make opportunities for them to prove it to themselves, really. She helped me when I first came to college. And she got time for you as well. Bubbly, friendly, very, very patient. Uh, and doesn't mind. Well, she's just a nice person. She really is. Debs, we're all so pleased for you. Um, this application, this nomination was um, a joint effort by all of us and we just want to wish you well and we're so pleased and just thanks for being you. Thank you, Debbie, for all your support. Thank you, Debbie. You've made computers a lot easier for me. Thank you. Thank you for, for being a good tutor. From the class. <laughs> <laughs> when uh, Lynn phoned me up and told me that I'd won, I didn't believe her at first. I was absolutely amazed. But I feel very honoured and really pleased. <laughs>